Hey gang, Jimmy D here, back with Free Game Pass Hunters, and in today's video, we are going to grab our rewards points by earning an achievement in a Game Pass game called Mafia Definitive Edition, where we are working towards 100% completion so that we can get that 1,000 gamer score or that platinum trophy or whatever you guys get in Steam. If you guys are just starting to follow along, I do offer a chapter select in the descriptions below, as well as a link to my playlist at the end of this video. And with all that being said, guys, let's go ahead and start up our game. Nice, easy one today, guys. Story mode among the shorter of the chapters. Not a whole lot to do as far as actual gaming. A lot of cutscenes in this one, guys. So let's sign in. And once it lets us, we are going to continue in story mode. You okay? I don't need anyone walking me home. So let's follow Sarah. Hey, we were talking about meeting up tonight anyway. Tommy, quit goofing off. I guess. And you can quit worrying about what he's gonna think. Not the point, Tom. He treats me like a kid sometimes. Hey, I get it. He's protective. He's seen things. We've all seen things. You know, we gotta talk about you stealing food. Hey, I cook it, so I get to say where it goes. Well, he won't thank you. Well, maybe tomorrow's finally gonna be the day he fixes his own breakfast. Could you knock on the door? Only got so many hands here. For me? Yeah, though it's not as much as last time. It's enough. Nona thinks you're an angel. The Dawn hates seeing food go to waste. And this? This has got to be Tommy. Sarah told us all about you. Isn't that right? You're a famous race driver, Tom. Everyone talks about you. Yeah, she's right. They do. Well, anyways, don't let the cold in, Juliet. I'll see you at church. All right. Have a great evening. Night. Buena noche, Tommy. Hey, Mama. Bu buena noche. Your angel Sarah brought more food. It's nice you do that. That? Well, a lot of hungry people on this block. Yeah. Well, it's, you know, it's a good night for a walk anyway. Don't get yourself killed on my account, Tom. I try to avoid it. That's all you got? You spend all this time with a lady killer like Sam Trapani, and the best line you got is, good night for a walk anyways? <laughs> well, it is, ain't it? Yeah, I guess so. Flowers for the lady, signore? Nah, we're good. Now I don't get flowers? When you let me take you on a real date and not some walk home for Luigi, My then you get the flowers. Yeah, that sauce. could happen. If Pop's not gonna stop me seeing one of you, I think he knows anyway. Luigi? Nah. These guys have been creeps to me for weeks. But I didn't tell you as I know what you like. I mentioned it to Dad this one time, and all of a sudden he gets you to be my knight in shining armor. So yeah, he knows. Huh. Well, like I say, means there's no problem with me. If he did, you wouldn't last long. I know what happened to all the other guys I dated. 
I helped hide the bodies. No oh boy. Yeah. So now we are. I've been trying to keep you safe, Tommy Angelo. All this time. Well, let's go someplace. Tomorrow night, maybe. The pictures, maybe. You can get your flowers. That'd be good. Oh! Hey and there, here come the punks. You stepping out on us? Piss off. <laughs> Don't cast the kitten, doll face. We'll let your boyfriend watch. Mm. What do you say? We going to have trouble here. Trouble started back when you tried to steal our girl, Chief. You saps aren't careful. Your girl? We'll end up in wooden overcoats. <laughs> Last chance to walk away. We ain't frails. We know who you work for. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. <laughs> I don't need Salieri. Or anyone else. Not for this. <laughs> well, you this guy? <laughs> then let's see what you got, cake eater. Mm. Where are you going here, sweet cheeks? Ooh. Back off! <coughs> Billy Trey. You're so kind of dish, ain't you? Get away from me! Hey. Twist like you's wasted on that grease. <coughs> Open him up. Those let's see some. <coughs> oh, come on. You even touched me and you're dead. You're wasting your time with a dead guy like that. You <coughs> You want some of this? You got it. Leave Get her alone, punk. Get away from her. Tommy. Oh. Oh, you send the tank, huh? Turn now. Hope you're better than me. Come on. Oh. That's what I got, you son of a bitch. Tank, done. One more. Nice one, sir. You got a good right hook. Clock. You that. You're bleeding. Come up to my place. I'll take a look. Well, you gonna come in and take a load off, or what? I'm wondering when you'd invite me up. The bank's closed, slugger. I'm just gonna patch you up, is all. Now go sit down on the couch, roll up your sleeve. I'm getting my sewing kit. Sorry, I'm gonna have to laugh at the bank is closed. Doesn't look too bad. You need something for the pain? No, I'm fine. You don't have to do that. What? I can see it fucking hurts, Tom. You want to pretend it? Don't go ask Polly to staple you up. What do you get? Compliments of the Don. <laughs> Take another. All right, you're gonna grin and bear this? Yeah, I'll be okay. Good. Cause I don't need the little old lady next door complaining to the super about all the racket. Just be quick about it, will ya? Oh, it's gonna take as long as it takes. 
the sloppier the stitch, the uglier the scar. That right. You stitched up a lot of fellas. Just my father. This part is sad, I guys. I really go after Luigi sometimes. He got pretty good at ducking dinner plates. So one day she stabbed him with her knitting needle. Right through the hand. What for? Because she was an ugly, jealous drunk. There. Not my best work, but it'll hold. This scar will be something to remember you by, if nothing else. <laughs> You're staying over. Can't have you stumbling through the neighborhood pie-eyed. Not when them hoods are out looking for you anyways. Yeah, okay. You got an extra blanket or something? No. And the heat's out. Yeah, right. Yes, I'll go. And boof. Good night for a walk anyways. Let's go ahead and continue. Get through this initial cutscene into the next chapter. Till we regain control of Tommy. This can't stand. Sarah's okay, boss. I took care of it. She started working here before she could see over the bar. I don't have a daughter of my own, Tom. I'd do anything for Luigi's little girl. So would I. We all would. That's right, boss. Anything for Luigi and Sarah. Do those bastards think this is fucking Luna Park or something? I'll rip them apart with my own hands. Our business is protection. But who's gonna pay up when they learn we can't even protect one of our own as she walks home from work? So what do you want us to do? Teach these boys a lesson. Break every bone in their bodies. Put them in wheelchairs. Bust their faces up so bad, even their mothers can't look at them without screaming. We know where they're holed up. My friend on the force says we should start looking into Chinatown. Then Big Biff will know something. Tommy, go to Vinny, get us some gear. Meet me at Biff's place. Yeah, okay. Leave these punks laying in the street. I want everyone to know we do not allow mad dogs to run wild in our neighborhood. You got it, boss. Some of these sons of bitches could still be on our turf. At Object this point, guys, we can go ahead sure and pause our game. Biff. Good, hun. Exit to the main menu. Quit our game. Turn in our rewards for the day. Head home. And for continued rewards, continued achievements and trophies, and continued videos, guys, you know what buttons to press. But as always, have a great day. See ya!